As evacuees make the trek to North Texas, our area is answering the desperate calls for help, sending relief and resources to Harvey's hardest hit areas. Marianne Martinez is live in Dallas to tell us more about this. Marianne. Well, good morning. The Dallas Police Association is pushing back its departure time to Houston because so many people in DFW want to help. Now, this all started off as a specific request from the Houston Police Department asking for specific things they need to keep doing their jobs, saving lives, and the response was massive. Now, it is Texans helping Texans. Today, the Texas Air National Guard is fueling up C-130s to head down to the Gulf Coast. Today, the Texas Air National Guard will be flying down there to pick up evacuees and bring them back to DFW. On Monday, the state began evacuating people from Galveston due to concerns there was not enough food or fuel and also more rain from Harvey. As we have been reporting, Harvey has just made landfall again. Now, Monday, a C-130 arrived at Dallas Love Field from, our, from a Galveston, rather, carrying about 70 evacuees who are now being housed in Irving. We are super excited to be able to help out our neighbors down south, and we just want them to know that the Dallas-Fort Worth area is sending down support, and we'll be there as quick as we can to just be safe and make sure that you're, you're ready to get up here, and we'll take care of you as soon as we can. Now, listen to the request from the Houston Police Department. They asked for clean socks, clean underwear. They also asked for real food, things like hamburgers, chicken breast, tortillas. They're hungry. They want to stay dry so they can keep doing their jobs. That was going to be loaded up here later on today and taken down to Houston. Reporting live from Dallas, Marianne Martinez, CBS 11 News.